What is going on, Irish Sports? Where we get lit and talk about Bay Area Sports, and you already know where we're at again here at the Oakland Coliseum. We were literally here on uh, Friday for the F. John Fisher Fest, which was just a great and wonderful time. And we are back again today. Uh, we didn't come yesterday. The A's lost us today, seven to zero uh, to the Blue Jays. We're playing the Blue Jays again today. Um, on the mound for us, we got Mitch Spence, and for the Blue Jays, I think it's going to be Bowden Francis. Uh, but today it should be a pretty fun get, pretty fun day as well. Um, there is a Mark Mulder and uh, Tim Hudson signing. So uh, they're doing these alumni Sundays now for the rest of the time being in Oakland. Thanks, John Fisher. You could have done that earlier. Anyways, and then you want to play 10 games away from Vegas. You know what? The A's on a gold brand is for Oakland. John Fisher is a horrible owner, guys. Just putting it out there. But other than that, we're going to enjoy our time here at the Coliseum, watch some Sunday baseball, and hopefully – get some good autographs from some legends come along with me guys let's go all right you guys so the parking lot's pretty lit some cell signs little tailgating you feel me we got the we got the A's and raider fans out here let's do it we are out here for the day um we're probably gonna I don't know if I'll do much of the parking lot. We'll probably end up lining up to actually go to that autograph signing, wherever that is. I don't know if you needed to buy a special ticket. I believe it might be on a first come, first serve basis, but we'll see. But gorgeous day here in Oakland, California. Yeah, the overpass. Awesome. Blue Jays fans travel pretty good. Um, but yeah, we're here at the Mount Davis portion. We're gonna go check in with this alumni Sunday signing. I don't know if I needed a special ticket or not. We'll see what's up. Hey right, guys, we're gonna head in here through the MM gate. Let's go through the checkpoint. Let's get it. You feel me? All right, just got through the gates. They've already been open for a little bit. Um, not catching batting practice today, y'all, because of this signing. Uh, people are already lining up already, apparently. They wouldn't let me through the other side, so I'm just have to go all, all the way around. So, yeah, let's get it. This is going to be an exciting signing. Let's do it. Uh, the A's little garden farm. Looking actually all right today. We're here. Let's go. Let's go to this signing. Tim Hudson and Mark Mulder. Exciting. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. And you could see everybody already like lined up. So we'll probably be some of the last people in there, but we are going to do the signing today, y'all. Look at the line. The line is huge for this signing. Very, very big line. Should've got here a little earlier. But uh, yeah, we're gonna wait through all this and see if we can grab some autographs. Let's go. The Mount Davis wall, y'all. All right, guys, the line is still going all the way down that way. We've definitely made some good timing, though. Zigzags all the way over there, and then you can see it. Uh, you guys, we got more past the line here, and those guys are signing, like I said, right down there. Got Comcast Sports Bay Area here. You guys, so we got Mark, Tim, and Ramon all signing autographs for us today. That is super awesome. Let's get it. We're close there. Be there in a second. That's dope. You guys are in the signing, Mark, Tim, and Ramon. Let's get it. Fun to be here. Awesome. 
Class acts right here. We got all the autographs. Let's get it. This was a great experience, guys. Awesome time. Great man right here. Thank you. Thank you. And we got a nice little towel, man. Did we get a bobblehead too? We still haven't Maybe gotten a bobblehead. Oh, <laughs> whoa, we get a bobblehead. All right, you guys, look at all the stuff we got from Alumni Sunday. Super, super cool. We got Ramon Hernandez again. This is he's such a cool guy, man. Tim Hudson, Mark Mulder. We got a picture with one of them. And then, dude, look, we got the big three bobblehead along with it, as well as the 2002 winning streak. These guys really did it back in 02. And what they've done for Oakland has just been incredible, man. Thank you guys for coming back to do this signing. This is awesome. All right, you guys, we got a lot of cool stuff right there. Super, super cool giveaway. That boy Cam Kong also got What's some up? cool stuff. You yep. feel me? Let's Woo! get it. Let's go. That Honestly, these Alumni Sundays are sick. I wish they did this earlier, but please come to Alumni Sundays, guys. It's all year. More legends are coming. Let's do it. He said it to his vlog, but point that I was going to say, yeah. More legends are coming, my guy. So, see you. My guy Cam Kong, bro. Hey, follow this man, you guys. Please follow do it. If you aren't subscribed to him already, what are you doing? Like, you're literally on his video. Go subscribe to him. Let's do it. Yep. You feel me? Hell yeah. Good. All right, you guys. We're here. Uh, no batting practice right now. They finished that, obviously. But, uh, yeah, we're just getting the field ready. And uh, it's a really nice day for Sunday baseball. Let's do it. Out here in the concourse, this guy, the guy has a big old Blue Jays hat. Uh, but, uh, yeah. Nice. It's probably going to be a decent turnout. Alumni Sunday, so a lot of people honestly ended up coming out to the park today. Preparation from the grounds crew here at the Coliseum is immaculate. Look at that, just getting all that wet. What's up, guys? Shay Langoliers is just stepping into the office. The coaches are just writing things down and getting stuff ready for today. Let's get it. Shay Langoliers. That's a starting pitcher right there, Mitch Spence. He's gonna go get warm too. Mitch Spence, gonna you know, warm for today's game. Doing some stretches. Warming up right there. You don't have to ask him after he gets done warming up. Sorry, like I said, I hope I can be there uh, sometime this year. I know we got some more alumni yeah, Sundays coming out. So I'm gonna work my butt off to get out there for you guys. It's a hang. Um, boy I got Barry, a couple of the OG. I love this guy. Uh, been a grand slam to center field that day. One of the longest balls I've ever seen hit in the Coliseum, uh, actually, since. And um, I was able to get out of the base of the gym. So. Um, I'll never forget the oh, he's back. Uh, Alemi Diaz is back, y'all. Finally, off of that injury. Uh, some of the old guys right there. Tim. This is his debut, guys. Mark Mulder. Right there. Ramon Hernandez. Hernandez. I love watching this guy growing up. Been in there, it was a close game. You know, I'll take these guys any day. What were your thoughts coming into today's game? You know, I was, uh, you know, it was really, really no different than any other sports. I mean, it was an important game, but I, you know, I just love being out there in those kind of situations. team guys guys the ceremonial first pitch will be thrown out by Mark Mulder Tim Hudson and Ramon Hernandez beautiful guys still got it thank you Tim Hudson Mark Mulder and Ramon Hernandez
Gotta love the A's game, man. Got JJ for the day, man. This is going right in it. Class act. He came all the way over here to sign for the kids, and that's not even the area to sign at. There you got this little bun right there, you know. But uh, yeah, it's ready to go. Let's do it. That's an ounce from the Mark Cox. Athletics. Go. Leading off. This third baseman, number 31, Toro. Adding second, the center fielder, number 33. JJ Bladey. Adding third, the designated hitter, number 25. Lineup intro is kind of broken. In the top spot, the left fielder, number 22, Miguel Andujar. Adding fifth, and in left field, number 22, Dad Cameron. Well, Dad Cameron's actually pretty late, y'all. Number 23. Shane, Let's get it, fellas! And he's at the first baseman, number 21, Tyler Soderstrom. Adding eight, and at second base, number six, Alexis. Alexis Diaz. Adding nine, the shortstop, number 12. Max Schumann. Max Schumann. All right, we have a little bit of a lineup that can come in today. Let's see what we can do. Number 40. Let's Spence. Let's get it. Spence. All right, game time, y'all. This kid has come to play. First pitch of the game. First pitch, 107. Hayes ended that play out right there with a nice little double play. Let's get it. Now we're batting. Didn't allow any runners across. So let's go. All right, Toro's got a 2 2 count. Nobody on. He's the first batter of the game at the bottom of the first. Then he strikes out. First out of the inning. Lede, here comes the pitch. And he gets a walk. So there you go. He had four quick balls on him. Now he gets to take a base. Takes about a piece. All right, Roker batting. Here we go. Here comes the pitch. And he's going to pop it out. Oh, he got it. He almost dropped it, but that's the second out of the inning. And right, Duhar. Nice. Nice. That was a big one. Oh. That's a good lift right there at the warning track. They caught the ball, and that's going to be the end of the first inning right there. No runs came across the board. It was still a 0 0 game. Toronto is going to score two runs right there. They got a single. They had some guys on. There's the score right there. Unfortunately, Mitch just let a couple by him, so Toronto will take those runs. Got him! What an arm by Wango Leaders. That guy's got a laser. For a cannon, you feel me? He just tailed them out. Let's see if they can. Oh. Tyler Soderstrom's out right there. Tyler Soderstrom's now batting. Here we go. Soderstrom, nice. That went right through him. There you go. Dallas Cameron, and he's going to stay there right at second, and that will be a single for Tyler Soderstrom. Let's get it. Here we go, Lemmy Diaz is batting, he's got two guys on. 
who comes to pitch. Diaz, he gets a hold of one, but it's going to be a little warning track again. Somebody will tag it up, and if he dies, Cameron will go to third. And he'll make it. There we go. Nice. A little sacrifice right there. It's the second out of the inning. All right, here we go. Max Schumann batting. Oh, and immediately pops up. He could have literally scored one run. Oh my God, Vladimir Guerrero Jr. could not see there. Caught it though. That's the third out of the inning. We are now on to the third, and the A's had a hard time doing anything getting some runs there. Good job, A's ended up that inning right there. They didn't allow any runs. Toronto is still winning two to zero, but there's the catch. You can see it. Got it. Going to the wall, boom. Next inning. Abraham Toro batting. Here we go. Here comes the pitch. And he is going to ground out right there. This will be the first out of the ZME. JJ Bebe. Ooh. Oh, he's gonna fly out right there. He'll be the second out of the inning. Two counts, two outs. Don't roll for batting. Here. Bottom of the third. Of the third. Got him. Third out of the inning. Now we're on to the fourth. The A's cannot convert anything there. It is still a 2 0 ball game. Concourses, horses, guys. Con horses. It's actually pretty packed for a Sunday. The A's got him to fly out. Ended out that inning right there. Now in the bottom of the fourth, they didn't allow Toronto to score, so still 2-0 ball game. Duhar got a hit. He's going, 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 going. Safe. There we go. He missed the first bar, but he got a double on that one. That was a good hit by Duhar. Nice. We got it. There's what we missed. We got it. It went right down right there. There you go. Guys, Cameron batting. Here we go. Comes the pitch. Oh, more than expected. Flies one right to center field. Is Andujar going to tag up? No. So that will be the first out of the inning. And Galier is batting with a guy on second. Let's see. One, two count. He's got two strikes. Here comes the pitch. And Shea strikes out right there. Dang it, Shea. Free swinger, but when he connects, it always goes in. Number, and that's going to be first base man, Number 20. All right, Tobias so is batting. He's got two strikes, though, with the guy on second. Okay, and just a little liner to the pitcher right there. And we get him out at first. And that is going to be the end of that inning. Now we are on to the top of the fifth. Still a 2 0 ball game. All right, the A's ended out that inning right there. Good job. Now we're on to the bottom of the fifth. No runs were scored. All right, you guys, you guys know where these seats here at the Coliseum, all the way, almost at the top of the 200 level. You're like tucked away in here, that's cool. There we go, Levis Diaz is not batting, he's got two strikes on him. There we go, here comes the pitch. Oh, strikes out right there. It's gonna be the first out of that inning. Here's the pitch to Schumann. And Schumann also strikes out right there. That's the second out of the inning. We're having a hard time hitting today, y'all. Toro's batting. Here comes the pitch. He's got two strikes and a ball on him with two outs. And he just strikes out, too. So, yeah, that's exactly how we're feeling right there. And uh, that's going to be the end of the inning. And we're on to the top of the season. And, uh, yeah, we are still losing 2 to 0. All right, uh, these are not batting. But now we're just over into the 300 section. This is parts of the Coliseum I really haven't covered. I really don't go up here that much because I like to have semi-decent close seats. But uh, yeah, here in the 300 level, I've been here millions of times. I don't think I've been on the concourses up here that much though. I know we're mid-game, but this is like pretty much the views here from 300 level. Um, like it's dead up here. Like nobody goes up to 300 level. But. That's cool. One of the concourses. If it's ever a packed, packed game, this is exactly where you'd sit. 
barely even know it here it was here because nobody really comes up here that much all right guys nice little 300 level concourse is here the first thing I'm giving you guys a Coliseum tour in the middle of the video, but this is cool. Alright, and then these are just more like concession stands that are closed down because nobody comes up here anymore. It's like dead. Alright, the A's did a good job in ending out that inning. I don't believe they let any runs across. We are on to the next inning, and we're about to hit, y'all. All right, which half is it on? Let's do it. There's the score, bottom of the six. JJ Bleday. Nice, except he's gonna ground out right there. It's gonna be the first out of the inning. Yeah, Roker batting. Nice, that's gone. That should be gone. Yeah, that's gone. Our Roker's gonna run the bases right there. fly ball and that is going to be out right there that's going to be the second out of the inning right there oh they some runs no, so far this year so, got him struck out right there that's going to be the side right there and uh we got to run across now we're on to the top of the seven at least we got to run across to the home run but now toronto's batting we got four hey, he's gonna get it he's gonna get this finish right here is it eckersley is it rick Oh my it's god, I think we're giving it to Ricky again. Oh boy, Ricky always wins that thing. Oh boy, Ricky's always winning. Yeah, uh, Ricky, Ricky won it. Oh my god, that was a photo finish. I mean, yeah, uh, this is the 300 level. So for the last game of the year, there'll probably be a lot of people here in this section. But yeah, um, 300 level vibes. Let's get 
this. What a hit. Yo. You need anything flashy. Something simple and I got the job done. JJ Bleday's got a guy on second. Let's bring him home. Nice. He's going to fly out. Abraham will he tag up. No, he won't. So that's going to be the second out of the inning. 2-2 two -two count. To Roker here comes the pitch. And that's fair. They're going to field it. And Roker is going to be out. Oh, we just out of the inning right there. We did score two across in that inning. Now we are on to the eighth. Let's go. We got to make some magic happen and do some great pitching. Let's do it. All right, so Toronto got a run across right there because they had a you know, sacrifice fly. So now the game is going to be tied. 3-3 three, three now at the top of the eighth. There we go. The A's got him out on a good play right there. So they only won, they allowed one run across. It's a tie game. Now we're on the bottom of the eighth. Let's see if we can get some runs across the board. Let's do it. Duhar strikes out right there. Got a quick couple of first strikes on him. He ended up striking out. So that's the first out of the bottom of the eighth. Right, Seth Brown batting. Here comes the pistol. Got two strikes. And he strikes out. All right, that's the first. That's going to be the second out of the inning. The leader's batting 1 1 count, but he's got. We got two outs here at the bottom of the eight. And he is going to ground it out right there to the second baseman. And that's going to be third out of the inning. And now we are on to the top of the ninth. And it is going to be filler time. Let's get it, guys. Let's go. So you guys know what we did to him on Friday. Because it is that time. It is filler time. Let's go. Mason Hill has got two strikes on Vladdy Guerrero Jr. Here comes the pitch. Got him! Run him up! Got him! That's that second out of the inning. All right, here we go. Miller, Bichette. Oh. He's going to pop him up. At least he cut that. Yeah, how do do? Here we go. We end it out. Top of the ninth. We're out to the bottom. Let's get another walk off. Let's go. Soto's been batting. It's a two ball, two strike count. No outs. Here comes the pitch. Soto's from got a hold of one. Soto's from just won the game. Oh, he's kidding. Wow, we all, we all, we all thought he won the game, but he did not. That was a loud, loud first out. Wow. All right, well, next batter. With two ball, two strike count, with one out, and here comes the pitch to Alemis Diaz. And he is going to fly out right there. And that's going to be the second out of the inning. All right, we're around the one more out here in the bottom of the ninth. And uh, it's up to the Matt Cuban to try to see what he can do. All right, here's the situation. Full count, bottom of the ninth. Max Schumann with two outs against Garcia. What can he do? Here comes the pitch. And he strikes out. So that will end the bottom of the ninth. We are on to the top of the tenth. We'll have a runner on second to start off these extras. And uh, he's going to capitalize on the out if he's going to come in and pitch for us. So if we can win an extras, let's go. Oh, oh no, that ball dropped. That's going to score a whole bunch of blue jays right there. That's going to score at least three of them. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Yeah. You didn't want that because now it's a six to three game. Dude, look at this replay. The coach literally got in the way here. Was that on purpose? Oh, my God. And now they're talking about it down here. They're like, what's going and out there because that was interference to be honest so yeah give us our out got him finally Austin 
out and sending out that inning right there. We're on to the bottom of the tenth. We have to get three runs across the board to win. To even tie it. See what we can do. Let's go over. For the batter. Fish him. Out of the tenth. And we got a guy on second, but we move somebody over. He grounds out. In the first out of the inning, but we move Kevin over to play. Good day, good day. Here we go. And he's going to ground one right there to first. But that will score Schumann. So we got a run across. We got a second out. And uh, we now we're going to do two more runs for two more times. See what we can do. All right, Brent Roke for batting. Bottom of the 10th. One ball, one strike. Here comes the pitch. And he was going to ground one right there. And they're going to ground it to the first baseman. That will be the end of the game right there. Now Toronto is going to go ahead and take this one against the Oakland A's. Um, it is what it is. And sell the team. You guys here and sell the team. Sell the team. Sell the team. Well, that is going to be the game, guys. We'll see you guys at the next home series. Then, well, we lost this one today, y'all. Six to four as Toronto takes it. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. It was definitely a good one. Oh, well, yeah. There you go. Yo, guys, we lost that one, unfortunately. Um, we lost it in pretty much the top of the 10th. Austin Adams gave up three runs. And that really just, you know, came to our demise right there. And that's what ended up having us losing the game. But it's all right. It was a really, really fun game in terms of just the vlog. The experience was really fun. The alumni Sundays were really, really cool to get some autographs from the OGA's players and legends that played on the team. So that was really cool. So we got some cool little memorabilia today. So I'm happy about that. It was honestly a good experience out here at the ballpark. But yeah, other than that, the A's lost. We won't see you guys at another A's game until they play against Kansas City. They go on a road trip after this. Our next vlog we're going to see you guys at is at an Oakland Ballers game, y'all. And then we got some big three basketball coming up for you guys. So, uh, yeah, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Like, comment, and subscribe. We'll see you soon. Stay safe, y'all. Peace.